recapacita y piensa en cómo debo ver. I worked so hard to keep Nikki shielded from everything, and now... She's killed someone. Whole damn city's collapsing around us. I need to get her away, safe, before it's too late. Come on. Yolanda said she's gonna call the police on you. Get in the car, let's go. Tell me you were set up. Tell me! I found him. The man who hurt her. I know who it is. What? Nick, we're out of time. We need to go. Now! Come on! No, they won't help us. But why? Because they're after me. Yeah, but we can explain. We can tell them about Damien. I'll, I'll tell them everything that happened. Nikki, listen. If we're caught, you don't say anything. Right now, I'm getting you two out of the city. You'll disappear and stay invisible. I'll take care of Damien. No, you're not making any sense. We don't have anything to hide, do we? It's you. Isn't it? It's complicated. So, everything I saw on the news, the, the murders, May Stadium, that, that was you? Oh, God. And since I've been gone, what, what did you do to get me out? I did what I had to. There used to be an ice cream shop near here. A hundred and one flavors. Everything I know is in Chicago. It's my home. And now we just start again? I thought things would be different. I hoped. Things will be different. I promise you. No more promises, Aiden. Where are we going? I'm getting you and Jax away from here. And then what? We can move out of state and stay with... No, don't tell me. Don't tell anyone. It's over. For you guys. But not for you. Didn't have to be this way, but what other options do we have? Are we okay? Remember when we were kids and I would follow you and you'd try and get away from me and stupid me, I kept trying. I didn't like your cars or hockey and your friends were gross. Yeah. 
I followed you because I idolized you. Like Jackson does. And I kept hoping that you walked me around, but... Eventually, I just hoped that you would look back. All I can say is I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not following you anymore. I know. <laughs> All right, sweetie. We're leaving now. Say goodbye to your uncle, Aiden. Are you coming with us? No. Your uncle's staying here. Bye, Jackson. Headline, who you looking for? Are you ready for this? Probably not. Play it anyway. I want you to run an errand for me, Mr. Iraq. Right. Bit a name and address for this errand, Mr. Quinn. Brinks and Pierce. Make it a strong warning. Get the family if you have to. Sir, yes, sir. What they do? Not your concern, Mr. Iraq. Give us your toe. And I'll let you be in charge of the auction next year. He's one cold son of a bitch. Fucking Quinn. It was just supposed to be a fast job, a big payoff, no problem. Yeah. Fucking mob boss. It ain't my place to tell you what to do, but in case you're wondering, Quinn's got some charity thing going on. At his hotel, the Merlot. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm sure. Nick, he'll never come back. I've driven her from her home, from me. I know she's safe. They're both safe. Now Quinn, lucky Quinn. He's brought all of this on us. He's the ghost I've been chasing. Well, now it'll answer to me.